I don't have to explain anything. What does it say right on your license plate? Don't drive stupid. And you drove, you went through two red lights because you're a moron. What's your name and badge number, sir? What's your name and badge number? I pay your salary, dumbass. Do you? Yes. I want to raise. Well, maybe you should get demoted. Maybe I should. Hey everybody, welcome back to San Joaquin Audits. Today's video is an exciting one and I cannot wait to bring it to you. Today's video comes to you from the channel Cash Valley Transparency. So before we started recording, Cash Valley Transparency spotted a trooper who flew by two different stop signs without having his lights on. He then stopped at a third one and then pulled into a parking lot. Cash Valley Transparency followed him into the parking lot and then began recording, which you're about to see right now. You guys are not going to want to miss this video. Stick around to the end. And do me a favor, before we start the video, go subscribe to Cash Valley Transparency and let them know I sent you. I'll leave the link in the description and the comment section. Let's begin. You like running led, red lights, man? You need to stay up and I'll explain what we're doing. I don't have to explain anything. I'm definitely not even near you, man. First off, I was responding to a call that I had to get. Did you have your lights on? The law says you have to have your lights on in order to break the law, sir. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. What does it say right on your license plate? Don't drive stupid. And you drove, you went through two red lights because you're a moron. What's your name and badge number, sir? What's your name and badge number? Tyrant! License plate is UHP258. Code three for filming. Code three for filming. Five, two, three, four, one, two. Okay. You wanna make this a big deal, we can make it a big deal. Okay. I'm have... just wondering why you went through two red lights, okay. man. I tried to explain it, okay? I was going to a call. I know, but you're supposed to have your lights on. No. No, I don't have to have my lights you on. You don't have to have your lights no, on. No, I don't. That's not what the Utah state law says. No. Actually, yes. Let's take a look at Utah Code 41-6A-212. This code pertains to emergency vehicles and the policy regarding traffic law exemptions while on vehicle pursuits. If we specifically look at Section 3A, it states, Privileges granted under this section to the operator of an authorized vehicle who is not involved in a vehicle pursuit apply only when the operator of the vehicle sounds an audible signal or uses a visual signal with emergency lights which is visible from the front of the vehicle. This trooper got caught thinking he's above the law and his policy, which he is not, but he doesn't want to hear it. Okay, All right. I was responding to a call. As part of my duties, I can disregard the traffic. Yes, when you have your lights on, no, sir. It does not say. Yes, it does. No. Okay. Yes, I it does. Identification. What law do you expect me to breaking? Okay. You confronted me on this thing. You've turned this into a bigger deal than what it needed to be. What law do you suspect me of breaking, sir? Okay. Let's just go get your plate. We'll figure it out that way. Go ahead. What's your name and badge number, sir? What's your name and badge number? Officer Delumpio, Sierra 36. I've had zero issues with your department. Okay. I filmed in your police station. I filmed all around this city and I've had zero issues with your police department. I just want you to know that, sir. Oh, that's good. What's your name and badge number, sir? No, we're not done here yet. What's your name and badge? Am I being detained? Am I being detained? Am I being detained? All right, then I'm free to go. Hold on. Am I being detained? Yeah, I'm being detained? For what crime? I don't know. He doesn't want you to leave yet, though. For what crime? You have to articulate a okay. crime that I am being suspected so of. Asked that I respond. Okay. I got you. You know when I got here. I don't know what happened before I got here. All I did he was ask him you. why he okay. broke the law. As far as I know, he doesn't want you leaving yet. So okay, then leave. what's his, then you have to articulate RAS. Do you know what RAS is? RAS. Reasonable, articulable suspicion. Yes. yes. Do you know what that is? I, yes, I told you. I just you have to have that to detain I, me, yes, sir. That is 
Correct. But okay. I just, he doesn't have any I to detain me. I don't know that. I just got Okay. It. Then I, if I am not being detained legally, then I am free to go. Okay. I believe he wants you detained. Okay. For I, what crime? I don't know. I just told you. So I go ask him. Here. I've had no issues with Logan Police Department. I've had no issues with the Sheriff's Department. But the State Patrol wants to cause issues because he blew through two red lights without his flashers on. I'm trying to get him on the radio so I can find out for you, okay? All right, well, the clock is ticking, man. This is an, an illegal detainment right now. If you guys want to be sued, if he wants to be sued and lose his qualified immunity, then we don't have a problem with that, all right? This is an illegal detainment right now. You can't detain me without a crime. You can't even get my ID unless you suspect me of a crime. Do you understand that? I do understand. Okay, then what is his problem? I don't know. I just told you I got you. So my sergeant's coming. You can talk with him. What's your name and badge number? No, we're, we're not going to What's your that. name and badge number? You refuse to identify yourself to me. I don't have to, okay. sir. You have to have RAS. Do you know what RAS is? I'm not doing this. I'm not going to sit here and argue with you. Do you know what RAS is? Place. No. Do you know what RAS is? You talk to my What's your name and badge number, sir? Talk to my sergeant. Kent. Talk to my sergeant. Get Kent Goodrich. You stay away from me. Get back there now. There is no... I'm in a public place, man. I'm just walking. Is that a problem with you? Yeah. If you keep coming at me, it is. Yeah. Okay. You want to talk to my sergeant? Fine. He's coming. But you stay What's your there. name and your badge number, sir? No, you have it. What's your name? Are you filming right now? Are you filming right now? Is your yeah, camera on? Absolutely. Good. We'll see what your IA department sees about you, sir. What's that? I'm just talking to Rob. He's detained. Am I being detained? You want to illegally detain me? Do you detain want to talk to my sergeant? Are you illegally detaining me still? Do you want to talk to my sergeant? I want your name and your badge number per your policy, no, sir. You already have it. No, I don't. He was a very polite gentleman, and as soon as he walked up, gave me his name you and his badge number. It. You know what that is, okay? So you've already read my name, okay? And my badge is right there on the car. You have to verbally give no. it, sir. No, I don't. Yes, you do, per your policy. Okay. Read I'm your policy. You How long have you been a cop, yeah. sir? Okay. I'm not honest with you, dude. Is this what you are? You're the tyrant of the Utah State Patrol? Says the guy who is coming out interjects himself in the stop. I didn't interject anything. I was wondering why you blew through two lights without your lights on. Hey, you can talk to my sergeant. We're going to find out about you, man. I'm going to pull your entire personnel file, and we're going to see all your complaints that you have, all right? It's going to be very well known. Okay. All right. What's your first name, man? I don't have to give it. I was just going to try to make a conversation. I appreciate that, man. You've been very polite to me. I'm but with this tyrant around me, not going to happen. Wow, I'm just being surrounded. Well, now there's four cops here for no reason. Four cops here because this tyrant ran red lights. What's your name and your badge number, sir? Officer Jason Barron, badge number 6 Delta 6. What was your name? I appreciate you, man. What was your name, sir? I didn't give it. You didn't give it? Nope. Oh, okay. We'll get the outpost. No, we won't. Okay. Am I being detained? All right. I didn't give it, man. You didn't give it? No. Okay. I would I like to know. I would it? like oh, to hey, know. I'm talking. I don't care I'm if you're talking. I don't care. What do you want done? I want to know why this tyrant ran two red lights for no reason. Okay, he didn't run two red lights. Yes, he did. No, he didn't. Okay, we're going to get the footage and we're going to find out. You got? you got footage? Does, no. he have his, does he have his camera on in his car? Not unless he needs to have it on. You not unless if he's responding to a call, does he not have to have it on? No. All right. So he ran two red lights. I'm letting you know. Okay. So um, where were these red lights? Um, 100 South and um, Center Street. And so, so he ran the 100 South and the Center Street. Yep. Okay. Because he and then he were, stopped at 400. Yard. He stopped at 400 North. Okay. Didn't have a problem stopping at that stoplight. Okay. And if he's saying he's going to a call and he's okay breaking the law going okay. through red, he red lights he, he says he, he said the one light was okay double. so you're gonna okay. believe the tyrant right no he's not a tyrant all right okay yeah but you, you, you have, i need proof show me proof all right you have proof 
I can get the cameras from the from the, the lights. From cameras, the lights. They don't have cameras on. They don't have cameras on those light. lights. Are you sure? Positive. All right. Well, we'll find out, man. We'll go find out. All right. And then I will. Give me a call. Okay? What's your name? Sergeant Branchley. What's your badge number? 177. Hey, I appreciate you being professional. I'm like this guy. Okay. Well, listen. You don't need to come up and flip people off and. And start I have out. a legal he's, right to flip okay. anybody off but I listen, want to, if man. He's, if he's handling a call, which he was, that's obstruction of justice. He's sitting at a stoplight not doing anything. No, but when you walked up here and he's talking to the Did lady, I flip him off? It doesn't matter. No, you I didn't. Come up and interrupt him while he's trying to handle another call. That's obstruction He wasn't of handling. He wasn't he handling. Was, he was literally standing by his car doing nothing. He's, he's get, going out He wasn't talk to talking to anybody. A, a lady who's... He wasn't talking to anybody. So you're distracting him. You will be arrested next time you do that. All right. Good okay? luck with that. Oh, well, Good luck with that in court, sir. Oh, uh, you bring your game. Do ball. you have proof? Need it. Do you have proof of that? I do have proof because he was on a call. I was helping him with the call. I was talking to the other person involved in the call. She parked right over here. I know. He I'm back. asking you, you do you have proof? You said I have to have proof of you him running the red light. I have to have proof. I'm yeah. not going to accuse him of running the red light. He told me he didn't. I believe him over you because okay. I know him. Yeah, and that's and you come up and flip yep. him off and act not you talking about professionalism? I flipped him off at the light, sir. It doesn't matter. And I have a legal right to do you that. Flip off all you want, you can flip me off. I don't give a crap. Perfect. Like that shows your character more than mine. It okay. Is. Awesome, man. You done? You're you're released. You can go. I wasn't being detained in the beginning. No, nope. nope, you can go. So I'm free to stay too. No, you can stay and stand there and film. Perfect. Put it on the internet. Do whatever you want. No to do. problem, man. Like I told this gentleman, I filmed at the Logan Police Department, I filmed at the City Hall, I filmed at Cache County, I filmed at his police department, I filmed at the jail, I filmed at the Sheriff's Department, no issues. All of a sudden, one highway patrolman has an issue and they, wants to run the red lights like an idiot. They didn't run the red light. Okay. If you get enter the intersection when it's yellow, it's not running the red mm -hmm. light. I... Never mind, man. Never mind. See if he's got the call screen on his. I'm not going in your car. You don't have to lock it. What do you think? I'm an idiot. Wow, you just called a citizen an idiot? Really? Is that your professional manner right there? Is that how you're being professional? I pay your salary, dumbass. Do you? Yes. Then I want to raise. Well, maybe you should get demoted. Maybe I should. Yeah. But guess what? Is that on the sergeant's exam? Your 10 Calling someone an idiot? Towards my, uh, my hourly wage does very little. You don't pay as much as you think you do. I and you don't pay any taxes, pay, sir. I pay, all, uh, I pay the same amount. You pay of taxes on the taxes you receive. Nope. How dumb is that? I pay taxes. You pay taxes on the taxes you receive from citizens. Okay. okay. When I go buy something at the store, Why is I pay wage taxes. Worth any less than yours? Yeah, I'm not talking about you, man. Time, You've been super nice to me. He's been I super nice him. to me. He I don't care. Friend of mine. I really a don't care. Character. I don't and care. You're the one here causing a scene. He's the moron that ran a red light for no reason, man. Okay. You guys could just leave and go back and do your jobs. No problem. And that's the thing. These D-bags don't really have a job but to put on a costume and go play buddy-buddy. Violate people's rights and canoodle with each other while in uniform. These officers made a grave mistake by backing each other up without knowing the full details of the situation. In doing so, they put the spotlight on all three of the different departments. And I know the people, myself included, are going to rally behind and support Cash Valley Transparency in his follow-ups. He deserves all the support that's going to be coming his way. And if you guys aren't already, go subscribe to his channel and let him know I sent you. He's already done an amazing job of following up with the North Park PD and the Highway Patrol and filing complaints. Those videos are on his channel. I'll show small clips right now, but I highly recommend going over to his channel, subscribing, and watching the full videos on his channel. Let's check out portions of those clips. Uh, yesterday, I went to file the complaint against the two uh, highway patrol officers. I also emailed the lieutenant and uh, I haven't heard back from him yet today. Hopefully he watched the video by now. And uh, waiting to hear back from him as soon as I do, I'll let you guys know. Is there a... Uh sergeant or a lieutenant I can speak to? Is there a sergeant or a lieutenant I can speak to? Is she helping you? No, she just kind of ran away just like you did. Oh, 
sorry, I thought she was helping you. No. Um, can I get your name? No, I just need to speak to a sergeant or a lieutenant, please. Okay. I'll about see. filing a, a complaint against an officer. Okay, I'll see. Who's Perfect, there. thank you. So, where, where is your guys' jurisdiction line? Jurisdiction? We're about 1500 north when it changes over to North okay. or to Logan City. So, from North Logan. why would an officer from North Park Police Department be on around 400 north? Yeah, if he got called out. So if he calls for an assist, anything like that, if another officer calls or a dispatch tells him to go, he'll go assist. Well, you got to consider... There was no sheriff's department called. The calls that were in place at the time that the call came through. That's the reason why our guy was even there is because most of the Logan City... Do you know about the call that I'm talking about? I do. Okay. I do. I've heard a little bit about it. Okay. Do you have a, do you have a copy of your uh, policy that I can have? Ooh, our policy manual is like 900 pages long. Perfect. But you can email it to me. No, the policy is available online. You can I tried looking on your website, but it's so uh, just unorganized. All right, let me ask you a question since you're a sergeant. If you approach me or if I approach you and we have an interaction, is it your policy to give your name and your badge number? Sure. No, I'm just asking, is it your policy? Yes. Okay. Awesome. So that's one of my complaints that I have because the officer didn't want to give me his name. He ran off like a scared little chicken and then he just kept pointing at his license plate. All right, that's going to do it for today's video. Let me know your thoughts below. Also, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a thumbs up. So once again, if you are not already subscribed to Cash Valley Transparency, you are not going to want to miss out on the opportunity to go subscribe to him. It's free. You don't have to pay anything. Just go subscribe. As always, thank you for tuning in. This is San Joaquin Audits, and I'll be back with another video soon.